Hi guys, welcome back to Developer Funnel. And today we are going to talk about how to deploy the React application on Nginx. Means how we can take the application to production. Although the application that we run over the node environment is basically a local environment, but to take it to production, we need a production server which can manage my load, which can handle the multiple requests. For doing all this thing, the best choice is Nginx. Now, Nginx is a very high performance server that manage your load and keep the application always up and running. And also help you to serve the static files as well. Now, how to get the Nginx? To get the Nginx, you simply have to download the Nginx. Just typing download Nginx for your OS. Once the Nginx is with you, the next thing that you require is the React application. If you already have a React application, it's good. If not, then I'm providing a description in the link from where you can get already running React application. So in my React application will look, look more like this. I'll go to the folder where I have the application present. This is a folder of the application and it's basically helped to show all the property in the Texas. Now, if I have to take this application to production, first of all, we have to make a production build. Step one to take an application to production. First of all, create a build. How? Open your command prompt, your application is running and type npm run build. Now, when you say like this, it create a build for your application that you have to take to production. In a production, we don't have to take package or JSON or node module, no file like this. We need to take to production. We just have to take this build folder to production. Now our build is ready. If you go back and check, see our build is ready with us. Now, once our build is ready, now we can deploy this to the Nginx. How? First of all, in your root folder, anywhere in the root folder for Mac is triple W folder in the var. I say slash var and triple W in windows in a C drive, just create a one triple W folder. Then create a one folder for your application. I'll say react app. Now, once your application is ready, what you'll do is the build that you have created. See, it don't have any package or JSON, no node module, nothing. Take it and put that in this react app folder. Now you are ready to deploy the application. How in the system, we have one nginx configuration file nginx conf. If I search on the internet, like say path for nginx conf nginx dot conf in Mac. Now by default in the Mac, it's user slash local slash etc and nginx in the window. It's directly in the C drive one nginx folder in that nginx folder. We have one file called nginx conf. It looked like this more like a text file like this. Now this file already have some server configuration here. We can specify on which port we want to run the application on which server name. What is a proxy? Are we implementing the SSL and is it SSL certificate? All these things you can mention here. Now, suppose I want to run the react application. I'll say like this, I create one server and I'll say, listen to the port number 8081. Server name is localhost. The directory is var triple W react app because the, that's a, what we have just created in a triple W folder. We have created one repository uh, like a folder. Sorry. This is a react app, right? So we have given the path of that as well. And we specify the file that you have to pick is an index file. If you check your build, no, in the build, you will find one index file from which you want to run your application. Now, once everything set, everything on a place, just open up one command prompt from any location and type nginx just nginx once you type this nginx server started 
Now what you do, just go back to your browser and type localhost 8081. When I say like this, it will loading my application and let's see. Now see, we see the application running over the Nginx. We'll close this and one more thing I want to show you. Nowhere in my command prompt, I'm running my application. See, no application running over the node server, but now application is completely running on the production. Just to give you a heads up, I'll do something like this. Let's see. See, it's a Nginx. Means this route is not available. That's why I just go to no, not found page of Nginx. But ultimately, this application is running on the Nginx. And that's how you take an application to production. For, for more details, do subscribe our channel. And we are soon going to upload one video. How to deploy the React application on Docker. And for documents, as well as the code, the links is given in the descriptions. Thanks a lot.